welcome back to Portman Road. We are getting to the stage of the campaign where every game feels significant, but this could prove to be a season-defining fixture for Ipswich Town. Lower tier of the Sir Alf Ramsey stand as he made his way to that corner to take the set piece. Morsi delivers in, and it's a comfortable catch for... I think it's a penalty. Dawson. I think it's a penalty. And Jeff Eltringham has awarded a penalty! It's Connor Chaplin. It's saved by Dawson. Saved by the legs of Cameron Dawson. Chaplin went down the middle. And the long legs of the 27-year-old goalkeeper kept the ball out of the net. He's defended one-on-one -on -one very strongly. Windass, left-hand side, delivers in towards Michael Smith. And Wednesday take the lead. It's a fabulous header for Michael Smith, who scored in the reverse fixture. Flint clipping one out to the left-hand side from the free kick. Marvin Johnson helps it infield to Bannon. Bannon helps it into the penalty area. Might drop for George Byers. And Wednesday double their lead. 33 minutes gone here at Portman Road. And Ipswich already have a mountain to climb. Comfortably wins the header. Loose touch from Morsi, but Clark able to get there first. But Michael Smith might be in here. Smith, he's round Walton, but he's taken it wide. Just held up. Palmer, back to Bannon. 20 yards out. Volk's coming onto it straight at Walton. Ipswich Town at sixes and sevens there. A massive let off. for six games Broadhead is he fouled by Ayorfa yes he is it'll be a, an Ipswich Town free kick in a really promising position Broadhead and Humphrey standing over the free kick it will be Broadhead oh! and it's in it's unbelievable from Nathan Broadhead what a free kick off the underside of the ball into the back of the net Pick that one out! It's just beautiful and it's exactly what we needed. Pass it. This really looks nice, Ripswich. Chaplin gets away from George Byers and Byers hacks down Connor Chaplin. Free kick to Ipswich Town. Standing over the ball with intent. It will be Davis. And it's, yeah! in, the and it's in the back of the net! I'm not sure who got the final touch. The centre half. But Ipswich are level! Yeah, it, it looks like a great free kick. He's hit it with power, but the goalie's got his hands out for a simple catch. And it's just clipped one of the Sheffield Wednesday players and flown in. Oh, come on, the boys. In swinging from the far side. It's a deep one headed away by Aidan Flint. Chaplin goes for goal. What a hit. Straight down the throw to Cameron Dawson. But my goodness me, Connor Chaplin struck that well. Marcus Harness in midfield. Full drop for Michael Smith, but Smith's given it straight to... Freddie Ladapo are on the same team last season Smith and Ladapo Clark tries to catch out Cameron Dawson but it's just the wrong side of the crossbar donning a hairband this afternoon it's in towards Flint completely unmarked to the back post headed back across goal drops for Flint and the ball stays out he fires it over the crossbar Cries have come on Ipswich, emanating from the Sir Bobby Robson stand. In comes the throw towards Burgess. Drops back out for Clark. He'll deliver in towards Ladapo. Ladapo! Oh, it's just wired from Ladapo. On the swivel by the penalty spot. Not the cleanest of first touches. And that's it. The final whistle blows. An enthralling afternoon. In the end, nothing separating Sheffield Wednesday and Ipswich Town.